Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and if you are new here, consider subscribing. If you are also a return viewer, I appreciate your efforts of um, coming here. What we do here is that we tell us or we discuss the university programs we have in uh, various universities and some of the career opportunities we have within. So today we are going to look at one, which is um, Bachelor of Science, uh, Mathematics, with economics, mathematics with economics. Yeah, so this program is a mathematics program, but you also enjoy economics in addition to your mathematics education or principles that you are acquiring. So we are going to look at job opportunities within this program, but let's just look at the cutoff point at UCC because uh, they are very renowned university in Ghana and they are doing that particular program and they are very, very expecting they learn into this day. So let me tell you, the cutoff point for both male and female is 19. Both male, male and female is 19. Now, if you're a business student, you are qualified to apply for this program. If you're a science student, if you're a general art student with economics and probably elective mathematics, but if you are with economics and you also have a better grade in your mathematics, why, I mean, wisely, you can also apply for this program. The cutoff point is 19. I've explained cutoff points in so many of my um, videos, so you can check those things, all right? All right. So, if we get to know that the cutoff point is 19, now what is the program all about? It's all about doing mathematics, applying mathematical principles and economic principles to solve um, what problems, probably in business, right? So, we have um, business opportunities that one can enter if you study this program, and I'm going to talk about a lot of them, right? So, if you study this program, in fact, everybody is entitled to go into entrepreneurship. So, the first thing you have to think about is being an entrepreneur. You can easily become an entrepreneur when you have these mathematics and economic skills and it's going to help you a lot because you are going to be endowed with all the necessary skills and principles in businesses and mathematics. You can also become data scientists. Data scientists. Due to your mathematical principles or mathematical courses that you are going to do, you can become a data scientist. Data scientists collect data, manage data, and analyze those data to solve um, complex problems in businesses and organizations. So if you're a data scientist, in fact, your job opportunity is very large and there are a lot of people or a lot of companies hiring data scientists in Accra and Kumasi. So if you want to go into this program, you have to study a lot. In fact, if you pick one area or one course that you want to specialize, you have to read books outside your lecture notes so that you can become such a person as soon as you complete school. So that seeking job or going into business will not be very difficult for you, all right? Now, you can also become an actuary or actuary. These people manage and, and, and they, they collect data. They also collect data to manage and... Uh, business risks yes or managerial risks they make sure that the risks that are um, likely to come or likely to happen are being managed or are being reduced or are being um, alleviated so that the company will not incur a lot of um, losses you can also become an economic consultant economic consultant But if any business is experiencing losses and things are not going well, they hire economic consultant to, he also collects data, right? To give advices, to reduce um, cost of production, to come out with a better ways of manufacturing, producing and then making the entire business model so effective that the cost will be reduced and then the profit will be maximized. So as economic consultants, you go into depth of um, economics so that you know how to efficiently and effectively make good use of your resources and make a lot of profit out of that. So this is also a career opportunity in pursuing this program. You can also become financial planner financial 
planner. But a lot of people are making a lot of mistakes because they are not hiring financial planners in their own lives or, or in their own businesses. That's why they are incurring a lot of financial losses. But the truth of the matter is that financial planners are going to help you to plan your finances very well so that you don't incur losses. They are going to help you in a lot of opportunities, financial opportunities that you cannot even imagine. You can also become an investment manager. Investment manager investment manager if you want to go into investment or if you want to advise people or give recommendations to people with the best investment how to invest and uh, the best time to invest when it comes to buying of um, foreign currencies and other stuff all kinds of investments you can just study it go into deep of it and then you start to establish your own firm or you work in a particular company as an investment manager you can also go into real estate or as a real estate investor or um yeah real estate investor the real estate investor can work in hand in yeah, hand in hand with um investment manager in fact it's all about choosing the right investment that's the most important thing about investment so as when you check the market and you realize that the real estate is um actually booming or going on successfully you can just help people to invest in real estate or you personally can invest in um, real estate and to make you whoever you have um, wanted to be all right I uh, have also like marketing manager. You can also become a marketing manager. Marketing manager. Yeah. Becoming a marketing manager is not assured. It's not guaranteed as soon as you complete your first degree. The truth of the matter is you have to read a lot on marketing. Just read a lot on marketing and then in turn to become a marketing manager assistant or PA, personal assistant to the marketing manager, then you learn from them and you take the practical aspect or the experiences, you feel the experiences so that when the position is handed over to you, you can take it from there. So becoming a marketing manager is not assured when you complete to university. However, if you have somebody who can um, give you that position, fine, you can take it from there. But you have to learn a lot. You can also become a professor or a lecturer, a teacher. So, lecturer, teacher at a second cycle institution or senior high schools. Lecturer, to I'm not promising you that when you complete this program, you can become a lecturer. You need to go into your master's, your PhD, and if possible, your doctor's degree. Like your your professor's degree yeah that's what i wanted to say so it is up to you to further your education and then explore the opportunities we have within so we have a lot of opportunities when it comes to mathematics particularly and economics you can also work at the bank yes as bank um economics or examiner you can work at um, insurance companies you can work in um a lot of um, companies if you have economics and mathematics because in this data world that we are living in mathematics and economics who are capable of analyzing data i mean assembling data and analyzing data to solve problems are more likely to be hired and are more likely to fit in into um, the career prospectus or the career requirements that the organizations are requiring or are in demand of so friends consider subscribing to this channel and let's keep in touch to know the career opportunities we have within our various programs so that we know the perfect program to choose at the university and we go for that one because education is very expensive now and we need to get to know where we are going after the four-year degree that we intend to pursue at our various universities thank you and until we meet again have a good day.